again the same place I was the other day and um, it is the second day now of homeschooling because I started homeschooling my children on Tuesday uh, with the older one. Um, she is 13. She didn't seem too interested that she had to basically go online and register at 9am. It, it just seemed that she wasn't interested. But to my surprise this morning, was it this morning? Yeah, it was this morning actually. I actually saw her taking a live lesson, whatever it is that you call it, <laughs> this morning just after 9am so it's really encouraging. It goes to show that she's, she's taking it seriously. I mean she she has been doing her work but I didn't, there wasn't, the structure wasn't as I would have wanted it to so hopefully she's, I, I feel like there's, there's more of a structure at this time but how about you, if you are homeschooling did you find that if you've got like teenagers or what have you, it looked as though they, you know, weren't really too interested. Even though they're doing the work, the structure isn't as well organised as you would have wanted. And all of a sudden they've surprised you and they're sort of like getting onto it now. Because obviously now, maybe before they didn't realise that there was going to be another time when they wouldn't be at school. You know, if you're finding out, don't forget to comment on my page, welcome to Roberts to like and even share. Don't forget to press the notification button so that all the videos that I do come up and running straight to you. So I actually found with the first lockdown, I was really determined that with the three younger children, that when they went back to school, they would actually progress. So that when they went back to school, so that the first day, they would have gone up a grade. So what happened was I spent time, you know, buying all the learner, book, the learner books and things like that, even though they, they could do work online. I, I've got to think about books. So I was, you know, spending time uh, preparing their work from some of the, the books, etc. And with my younger one, the eight-year-old, I made sure that over the six weeks holidays, I was still doing work with her. She'd work, even if it was just for 20, 30 minutes um, in the morning, Monday to Thursday, she'd have Friday off. So what happened was, when they went back to school, the first day, the, old, the younger one, the teachers could see that she had progressed. They, they set her up a grade. And then um, with my son, it's gone a bit blurry, sorry, with my son, he actually, he does really well anyway. So he um, became a head boy of year six. And then with my daughter, she was given an assessment, uh, a reading assessment. And most of her friends got a certain average reading assessment, and but she got a very high reading assessment, which she was really, 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 really pleased with. But I mean, if you can see, that um, through your homeschool, you can actually see that they've actually benefited from it. Don't, it'd be good to hear your comments. Don't forget to comment on my page and um, I'll speak to you soon. Bye bye.